Hey guys, uh, this is Chess here again with another uh, video tip. Uh, but because I do pretty random uh, tips, so um, today it's uh, Excel 2013 previews turn. Um, so I was actually working on a sp I was working on a spreadsheet, and then I thought uh, it would be beneficial for you uh, to learn as well how to get rid of um, uh, duplicate data in a column. So uh, here's our spreadsheet that we will be working with, and um, it, uh, as you can see that uh, from cell A4 to A6 we got uh, data 3, value data 3 repeated 3 times. I want to get rid of that. So how, how do we do it? So uh, first select uh, the column that you want to um, filter, duplicate. And the second thing is I'll click on the data tab. And then there's a button called uh, remove and duplicate. Now um, you can actually get rid of uh, duplicates just by clicking that button as and then um, you can actually select if your data actually has a header so uh, sometimes we don't ha have headers but uh, mine one does have header so the data uh, a a1 uh, cell is my header so i just uh, keep that checked and columns are um, selected uh, already so when i click okay and th there you go. Uh, it will actually come up with the message where it says uh, two duplicate values found um, and removed. So that's the thing that we, we are left with. But uh, sometimes uh, we want to do something a little bit more advanced and fancy. Uh, like say for example, um, we just we want to keep the original column as it is and then uh, want to copy all the uniques in s somewhere else, right? How do we do it? So uh, select column A again, and then under the same tab under data, and there's a section called sort and filter. Under the advanced, uh, when you click on the advanced button, it will come up with the, um, um, you know, um, what action do you want to perform? So um, the filter, this for the first option is pretty much the same thing as uh, uh, clicking the remove uh, duplicate button here, um, but we want to copy it to another location now, uh, the uh, the unique data that we have. All right. So as you can see, the list range that we are filtering is from um, uh, cell number A1 till cell number A7. Um, where I want to copy it to, uh, click on that little icon uh, just beside that text field, and then either you can type it or you can select it. So I select B1 here. All right. So and then click on that uh, same icon again. It will actually take you back. And then select that. Uh, check check uh, this checkbox which says uh, uh, unique uh, records only. So press OK. And there you go. Uh, uh, that's actually uh, the data that we, um, the, that, that's our unique data. And that's uh, the data with the duplicates. Now you can ex uh, extend uh, uh, this stuff to uh, multiple columns and rows as well. Uh, now, as you can see, that uh, our um, row, row three and four are the same here. Okay. Now, uh, how do we get rid of uh, the duplicates in there? So, what I do is um, I just select the data like that. Okay. Um, or you can just simply uh, select A and B columns and uh, go back to that advanced uh, um, uh, screen again. Uh, click on the advanced button, and uh, of course, I mean uh, you can actually select the same thing, copy to another location. So we have uh, our list range uh, selected, um, and we want to copy it to. Uh, I just select uh, uh, C and D, uh, column C and D. All right. So I'd, I have to. Uh, you can actually just select one column. It doesn't matter. Uh, so and uh, uh, go back and then select that checkbox again and press OK. There you go. So that data is unique um, per row. So it's not getting rid of um, uh, you know the um, as, as, as in columns. It's actually getting rid of uh, as in rows as it applies from top down. Um, Anyway, um, so we have actually got rid of uh, what the duplicate row that we have, as in um, A4 and B4 uh, cells. Um, I hope uh, that uh, um, 
you will actually be uh, proficient now to actually you know uh, um, uh, get rid of duplicate data. Um, for random video tips, so just subscribe to my channel. Uh, I will actually come up with those. Uh, I only do video tips in the way of uh, I think. Uh, it can be useful to others. Like, uh, let's say, for example, this one. Um, so, I'll actually see you some other day uh, with another video tip. Uh, till then, uh, goodbye.